The owners of the Grandview Apartments in Paso Robles announced they will go out of business instead of making repairs to their housing units. This comes after tenants sued over the living conditions. KSBY News reporter Michael Torres has more on what this means for tenants. Karina, starting today, the owners of the Grandview Apartments can give their tenants notice to vacate. Now, tenants will have between 60 to 90 days, depending on how long they lived at the complex, to find a new home. Now, John Fowler, CEO with People's Self-Help Housing, says this could leave 54 families without very many places to go. In May, tenants filed a class action lawsuit against the owners of the Grandview Apartments in Paso Robles. Tenants claimed they were living in units that were insect and vermin infested, had cockroaches, rats, and bed bugs, and even mold. After the court allowed for Grandview to inspect the property to see how costly repairs would be, the owners decided to instead shut down their business and sell the property, leaving residents with little time and affordable housing options to find a new home. They would become unstable, and, and obviously because they're living hand to mouth and they don't have a lot of resources, not a lot of savings, and so that means that you know, if they lose their housing, there's a good chance they lose their job. John Fowler, CEO of People's Self-Help Housing, says there's less than 2% vacancy for housing units in Paso Robles, making this decision difficult for Grandview tenants. Stephanie Barclay, legal director with the San Luis Obispo Assistance Foundation, says they will work with the community to help find these tenants housing in a tight market. In Paso Robles, Michael Torres, KSBY News. The owners of the Grandview Apartments have been ordered to pay $1,000 to each unit for relocating and return the full security deposit within a week after the tenants move out.